Hello guys, and today we are here with Kirby's Return to Dreamland episode 3. Um, there's been a quite long gap between these episodes, but uh, you know how we are here. Uh, we come back to things when I feel like it. So, oh yeah, well this won the poll for Nintendo games I should play next. So that's why we're playing this today. And due to the fact that my best trending videos are Kirby videos, why I don't know, but they are so basically uh i did this before like months ago but the footage was kind of destroyed because my old hard drive exploded or something i don't know what happened to it so i can't get that footage back so basically we're starting here with stage four so let's walk into stage four and check it out so here we have a key and a um angry cat flying thing so let's run away from that while we book it with this key before we end up dying. Oh, good, a copy ability. Let's eat him. So, uh, I want to talk about, um, so basically I'm going to try to do one video per week, um, going forward. Uh, so expect at least one video per week, um, in the future. Uh, I just totally messed that up. But anyway, one video per week going forward. Um, I'm hoping that that will help my uh, channel get some more uh, traction since I've been doing this since like 2019 and I've not really done that much, all things considering. So yeah, I'm going to try to do one video a week, as I said 10,000 times, and that's basically all I have to say about that. Uh, now Kirby is going to blow a hole in the ground here so we can go into this bonus area. Let me turn up my audio a little bit. There we go. Alright, I'm gonna step on that. Oh, I, I remember what I have to do for this. So, what you have to do is throw the bomb at the thing and then run. But, since I'm stupid, I can't do that. But, basically, throw the bomb. And I missed. I think we're gonna need a fail montage soon. Alright, I made it in just in time. Now I have all the energy spheres, so that's nice. Alright, let's continue progressing through the level. Uh, this stage has a boss, which from what I remember just looks like an overgrown bowling pin. So we're going to fight the overgrown bowling pin today. Because, oh god, it's a dark level. Dark levels are kind of annoying, you know? Have you ever really met anyone that likes a dark level in any game? I just don't like that stuff. Oh god, I just walked into a cat. Uh, anyway, there's tr they're trying to whip me anyway, so I shouldn't feel bad. Oh god, sleeping thing. Uh, never mind that. Uh, oh god, there's a cat. Why are there so many cat enemies in this game? Alright, let's get this hamburger. The Hamburglar. Uh, that was a gear sphere, but since we already got all of them for this area... It doesn't matter. All right, our candle is burned out, so we're gonna toss that in the lava, and we're gonna try to survive here. Ooh, is that a beam attack? Okay, I, I don't know how every single one of those bombs missed, but that that's fine. Right, let's grab our beam attack here and fight whatever's in here, which is a water galboros. All right, let's kind of like Galados portal speaking of which i kind of want to do a portal let's play on this channel so maybe i'll do that soon but uh let's kill this guy he's pretty easy he's kind of weak he's kind of easy and he got clapped on pretty easily so i'm gonna drop this ability because there's always a hidden thing that you need to get with their with the boss's ability so let's go do that real quick plus it'll help us with these lava segments get this glizzy down here um Forget how you do the water, like, fountain thing. There you go. Alright. Uh, let's go through here. Watch out for these things. And we get a 1-up. Even though I ne I don't think I've ever... Well, I do die a lot in this game, actually. But, like, Kirby Star Allies, I don't think I ever die in that game. Like, I have, like, max lives in that game. Maybe after this one, I'll do Kirby Star Allies. Or the, um, Kirby Forgotten Land, too. That would be pretty fun. 
I really like Kirby in the Forgotten Land. Um, oh great, I just died to a lava ball. Oh god, I'm getting clapped by these things. Watch out for this bat. Oh no, now I'm invisible. So I don't have to worry about anything trying to hurt me. And I can just walk right through and pick up that, um, what are those things called? I think that's a dumpling. Um, can I go through to the bonus area, which I probably already have the thing since I completed the gear spheres. Uh, yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna bother. I don't feel like doing all that work for nothing. Alright, let's keep going through here. And through the door. We finish a level because I want to fight the boss. Alright, we get, we get a sword power up. Gotta grab that meat. Uh, cannon down here. And we're going down here. Um, oh good, super sword ability. Let's inhale that thing right there. Alright, let's... Oh, oh, he's, he's hitting his Jedi moves. And chopping the rope. Oh, I almost got killed by that. I wonder if I'll pull out the fish. That's apparently really rare from a video that I saw. And I just slapped my desk. Hopefully you all didn't hear that. Uh, let's chop all of these things. Got Meta Knight Sword. A Meat Cleaver. A Fire Thing. Get rid of that. Go down the ladder. Chop all of these guys. Oh, I'm not going to bother with that just for the sake of time. Because I already have that. And I don't feel like bothering with it right now, so... For the sake of time, we're skipping that, so we can get to the boss and keep this video short. Especially since I already replayed this, and I don't really feel like playing it over again when I don't have to. Oh, wow, I hit the top. Let's go. Kirby hitting the jig over here. Break dancing. We got a one-up. Alright, now it's time to fight Bowling Pin, dude. At least I think that's what the boss is. So let's go up here to the boss. Now, sadly, it probably will not play the um, cutscene for putting together the ship for this part. So uh, leave it up to your to your imagination for what you think that looks like. You just imagine Maglor being happy and the ship part connecting to the uh, the lore. At least I think that's what it's called. All right, here's our bowling pin, buddy. Here he is. Strike. I think that's what you say in bowling. Anyway, he's gonna juggle some skulls. Let's toss the water at him. He is a uh, not water liking type of person, it seems like. Oh god, he's turning into a tornado. Let's run away from that. Okay, let's attack him. Water, 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 water. Oh no, I lost my water ability. Alright. Okay, I'm, I'm taking an excessive amount of damage here. Probably should have grabbed a different copy ability. One that can, like, attack him while he's in the air. Alright, he's at half health, half health. Teabag on him a little bit. Gotta keep up the toxicity. Okay, he's, he's coming, he's coming. Gotta, gotta stay away. Alright, he's, um... I don't know what he's doing right now. He's getting a little crazy. Now he's punching the air. Kind of like this game that I've been playing on the VR a lot where you, like, punch blocks to music. It's not Beat Saber, but it's, like, free Beat Saber. I highly recommend it to anybody that doesn't want to pay, like, $30 for Beat Saber. It's basically Beat Saber, but you use your fists instead, which is way cooler. Um, I don't have the ability to record it, though, so there'll be no videos of me uh, playing Beat Saber. Plus, I don't want to get copyrighted for playing music on the channel, so we're not going to do any of that today. We're not getting copyrighted. So we beat the big overgrown bowling pin. And we got the gears, not the gear sphere, the part sphere, or whatever you call it, I don't know. 
So basically we have it again. Uh, Kirby's going to hit the jig for us. Bravo, Kirby. Give him a little round of applause. Uh, anyway, let's keep going. Uh, so that's it for this video. I want to keep it short since uh, I don't want to go into the next world just yet. I want to say that for another video. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, intro back into this game. And expect more content. Uh, as I said, at least one video a week doesn't mean that there isn't going to be more. So if I'm feeling generous that week, I might upload multiple videos, but at least one video a week going forward. And I'll see you guys next week or possibly sooner. Bye.